वेलकम टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल पावर पॉइंट यूनिवर्सिटी मेनी ऑफ माई व्यूवर्स एंड सब्सक्राइबर्स हैज रिक्वेस्टेड मी टू क्रिएट मोर ट्यूटोरियल्स ऑन एनिमेटेड बुक्स सो हियर आई एम टूडे विद अनदर एक्साइटिंग ट्यूटोरियल यू कैन सी दिस इज कॉल्ड द एनिमेटेड फ्लिप नोट वेर यू कैन सी दे आर सिक्स ऑप्शन एंड आई हैव क्रिएटेड रिबन इफेक्ट देयर एंड प्लस दे इज अ पेन होल्डर to hold the pen and when i click it will show you the title 1 and it will reveal the information there similarly the title 2 and title 3 4 5 and 6 if you want you can add it more if space is there and then i have downloaded a pen from the internet and i just uh, added the pen there so if i click it will just reveal the information and similarly i have added some more uh, slide where uh, we slide a different animation or different appearance i can say and this is the third one so let's see how to create this slide in powerpoint add a new slide go to view and enable the guides so this will split you can see there's a line there which is the left and the right side and i'm going to add a shape uh, i'm going to select a rectangle select the rectangle and make the height as a 6.8 inches and the width as 4.8 inches you can make it no outline and you can change the color to some color like this a brown color or golden brown color and you can just edit the shape and select the rounded corner rectangle and just reduce the curves press control d to make it duplicate and outline you can make it a white color and shape fill make it as no fill and you can give some dash lines there set shapes and select a rectangle this one i am going to make a paper for this you make the height as 5.4 and the width as 4.1 inches make it no outline and the color should be white bring it some click it and bring it to the other side
and choose any color uh, for the time being then we can change the color later on I'm just going to use some light color and you can just press ctrl D to duplicate it and give some darker colors and place it exactly on top of that and I'm just going to cut the one corner of this so go to insert shape select one rectangle and just make it transparent group it and give some different color maybe orange and this also I'm just going to use some different color maybe this color and add the title to it I'll just say title 01 I'm going to use a font called Oswald and make it uh, very loose increase the size and bring it here at the top of the arrow and give the same color the golden color and select this as well group it and I'm going to add a text so that when I click it should reveal the text the description you can say it and make it golden color sorry the orange color and just bring it on the top you have to make sure that the text should not be visible there so you can make either you can bring this up bring to front and even the spiral binding should be visible so I'm going to send this to back and the text select the text again and just say send back I think this is okay And I'm just going to copy the arrow to the other side. Press Ctrl D. You can ungroup this and then rotate the arrow. Bring to the other side. you can change but let it be like that and for this I'm going to use the animation called peek in go to animation and select peek in and this one it should be from right this make it with previous and the delay of 25.25 seconds so if I click you can see this animation is okay and now I'm just going to select all these arrows both the arrows press ctrl D do not duplicate it otherwise the animation will go if you duplicate sorry if you group it 
so press ctrl d you can add as many as you want depending on the the size how much space you have there so i'm just going to change the color of the arrows you can use your own choice of colors as well we can select the last one and change the color to blue and unhide it so select the arrow 3 hide and then change the color so this is the easiest way you can uh, do it and instead of just moving the arrow here and there and unhide it the last one go top hide this change the font color and unhide it so you can see the color colors are changed now i have not added any ribbon there if you want you can add some ribbon one more important thing which i forgot to show you here is i just select uh, this the left side the arrows and bring it uh, beneath the the spiral binding here first uh, make sure it is aligned properly and then you can just say send